Welcome back to Sony with our new e-reader Wi-Fi. A few of the things we're going to cover today are certain things such as web browsing and how to access the public library. First thing is when we go into our book, I'll show you how some of the web browsing works. You simply highlight a word and you can go into such things such as Wikipedia and Google. For this demonstration, I'm just going to use Google. Once I choose Google, it'll automatically bring me to Google via the Wi-Fi. Once in Google, I can navigate through and choose a web page that I prefer. I'll go into Wikipedia to show you how some of the navigation works through this browsing. The web browser used is an Android-based platform, so it's very similar to that of your mobile device and or tablet that you may already own. So you'll notice things such as to zoom in is your double tap. Once you double tap, the page will re-render and change the font to fit that size. As well as you have the pinch zoom for in and out. Every time you do a zoom via pinch or double tap, the screen will refresh itself. A few options you have while web browsing, I'll show you. Once you hit the right hand button, it gives you a few options. You can go back to your browser homepage, which gives you a couple key bookmarks, or you can add bookmarks by hitting more. So add a bookmark will just add that bookmark to your homepage. So every time you go to your browser home, you'll have things such as the thesaurus, the dictionary, Wikipedia, or social networking apps such as Facebook and Twitter. A couple other things you have are capture a screenshot. This is really handy if you wanted to take a certain part of a text or a picture from a certain website and keep it. As well as orientation. You can change the orientation from portrait to landscape as you would with um, reading a book. In order to do that, you simply hit orientation and it'll revert itself for you. So that's the basics of the web browsing.